Before we get into this video, I just want to say that the people that run Loco Wrestling, uh, when I made the last video, oh, the first video with it, uh, whoever runs their Facebook page or the promoters or whoever decided to uh, take my video and put it on their Facebook page and uh, definitely got a few views from that. Uh, definitely got a couple more subscribers for it and I want to just thank uh, the people at Local Wrestling for doing it. I didn't ask them to do it. They just did it out of the kindness of their heart, helping a localish small creator and giving me a little bit of a, you know, promotion. Uh, I appreciate that and I thank you once again, the people at Local Wrestling. And after doing that and after a fun, fun night of pro wrestling, the last time, there's no way I could not miss this show. And on a cold and rainy night, we headed back to that dead end street in East Houston. Another night of professional wrestling by local wrestling. Temperatures checked at the door to make sure everybody was A-OK -okay to come through. Superstar Sammy Guevara was in the house doing a meet and greet, hanging out with the peoples. Any the other wrestlers that night were also hanging out, taking pictures, and selling their merch. With some familiar faces from the last show. and a few new ones. Say this again just like last time the wrestling tonight was fantastic dog collar match got a little wild with broken glass and trash and a huge bump off the ring onto the floor. These girls were definitely getting extreme. And in the main event there was a deaf match with something I've never been able to witness live so I definitely crossed it off my bucket list but I'll be I'll tell you what, there was a moment in this match where I legitimately felt like my life was in danger.
and there was a point in this crazy death match where they started fighting outside the building it was completely nuts and bloody i loved every second of it That was a crazy, crazy fun night of wrestling and I had so much fun. I can't wait to go back to another show by local wrestling. But we decided to spend the night in Houston and go to something that's a little less violent. And we headed over a little outside of Houston to Seismic. Describing itself as an interactive museum is probably the most easiest way you could describe Seismic. It's so much more than just that. It's a, it's a feast for your eyes and just total sensory overload by what you're looking at There's so many colors and lights and sounds it's, it's almost too much to take in at, at one point um, it's a place you definitely got to check out like two or three times to really see everything and enjoy it man it was just wild I loved it I can't wait to go again I think this was my favorite room with all the lights. If you touch them, the whole thing kind of changes colors. It's really, really cool. weekend in Houston it felt really good to get out of town have some fun relax uh, not worry about the wheels of the uh, the world right now uh, anyway thanks for watching this video make sure to like make sure to comment make sure to subscribe if you haven't follow me on the social medias they're in the description below make sure to follow me on twitch by the way my twitch channel is uh, up and running I got my L uh, game capture card here we're doing some bit tweaking to the OBS and once I kind of get everything you know to the pinpoint accuracy that I like, uh, I'll be on there a lot more. So make sure to follow me on Twitch. It is X Handy Andy X. Uh, make sure to like Local Wrestling, their Facebook, their Instagram. I don't know if they have a Twitter. I'm sure they do. Uh, make sure to follow them. Check them out. Their next show, is, I think, is in March. Uh, I might be there. Might not be there. I don't know. We'll have to see. Uh, anyway, once again, thanks for watching. Have a good night. Take care of yourself. Wear a mask. Wipe your ass. And I'll see you in the next video okay peace